Hi, I'm Craig with Data Video. Today I'd like to show you a brand new product from Data Video, the RMC300A. This is the first new product that we're going to introduce in 2021. The RMC300A is a camera controller. It controls all of the Data Video cameras and it controls them in different ways. So, for example, I can control up to 24 cameras using IP. So if you want to connect your camera to a network, you can do that. In this example, I have all these cameras connected to the RMC300A with a direct connection using a serial control. So, for example, I'm going to show you the, the interface of the RMC300A here. Uh, all my cameras are, can be selected right here, up to 24 cameras. There's 12 buttons, but you can do a shift key and select up to 24 cameras. Camera one, I have right over here, it's the PTC280. This is our brand new 4K camera. You can see I'm moving it around, up and down and left, right. This is the PTC150. I'm gonna change over to channel two. And the PTC150 camera is gonna be controlled is right along with the PTC280. Our most popular camera, the PTC140 camera. I'm gonna shift over to three and you can see it moving. Don't forget about the PTR10 Mark II. This is a brand new uh, pan tilt head that we have, PTR10 Mark II. And you can see that I can also control that. So I can control all our cameras as well as a third party camera if you decide to go with the PTR10 Mark II. How do I do a preset? That's the other thing that a lot of people wanna do is I wanna do multiple presets per camera. Well, the RMC300A will do up to a, a 14 different presets per camera. So I have the uh, PTC140 NDI, it's a white camera right over here. I have it pointing at some props. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you, if you wanna do a, a preset, then I select this STR button, which is, means store, and I select that. And then these top button row, I can select any one of these, let's say this one right here, and that will select that particular angle. So I just have some presets I already did on here, and then I can actually push these presets and zoom into different shots on this prop table that we have. And let's go back to the some kind of prop over there and I'll go back over to the apples. And you can see how it just goes right back into place with these presets. Now, if you wanna control the camera in more detail, you have the option to go, there's a shutter button, focus button, an iris button, and a gain button. And if I have this, like for example, the iris button, I just move this knob and I can turn it, I can see how that changes the iris of the, of the camera just by turning the knob left, right. I can do that with any one of these, these buttons. The, really, the cool thing about this is it's got a five inch touchscreen panel so I can go see which camera is connected uh, just by looking at the camera and I can go into the details by selecting which camera I want and then checking out the white balance and some other details that you may need to know about that camera. If you have it networked, you can see what the IP address is just on the screen. So I have complete control of that. That's really important when you've got many, many cameras in your workflow. You'll see also on this five inch panel, you'll see the word switcher and recorder. Now that's not available yet. We hope to have a new firmware update for the RMC300A that will also be able to control our recorders and some of our switchers directly from the RMC300A. And there you have it. The RMC300A is a very powerful camera controller from Data Video. It controls all our PTZ cameras, as well as the PTR10 and the PTR10T, and controls all the functionality of each of these cameras through either serial or through IP. For more information about the RMC300A, don't forget to visit our website at datavideo.com. Also, don't forget to like us on all the social media and subscribe to our YouTube channel for sure. Thanks for watching.